dissect the world tears. You could spread the knowledge to children of all ages. Like mm -hmm. That's correct. All of these stories have an outstanding moral story for many individuals around the world to learn from their difficulties. They suffer throughout their life to, to pursue the education they needed for their future. All these three stories have one thing in common. To never give up study and not do anything standing in the way to gain that knowledge. Okay. So many individuals around the world will just give up if they find if they found an obstacle in their way and did not solve that obstacle. 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 But if you look at these three stories, do you ever see them give up on their lives? No. They never surrender. They always stand up and find the solution. To the okay. Problem. When you say no, and as if you are rejecting that idea, right? So when you say no, and then let it linger for two to three seconds. Okay. Let's start Okay. No. They never surrender. They That's good. They only stand up and find a solution to their problem. They don't let language or people demoralize them from pursuing their future. You should learn from these people who should inspire them to become like them. Strong, diligent, and most importantly, brave. What should I add here? Is that the end? Yes. Okay. Mm, you did, no, it did sound like an ending though. You, what's the last line? Strong, diligent, and most importantly, brave. Okay, so strong, diligent, and most importantly, brave. Five, four, three, two, one. Thank you very much, and good morning or good afternoon. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, and good morning. Whatever time that is, is it good morning or good afternoon? It's in the morning. Okay. Okay.